Hi, welcome to Maths and Tracks. Today I will talk about the Jacobi and gauss little eye tradeo techniques. These eye tradeo techniques are used to solve the n cross n linear system, starting with some initial approximation. These are relatively simple methods but are seldom used for solving linear system of small dimension since the time required for sufficient accuracy exceeds than that required for direct techniques such as Gaussian elimination. For large system with a high percentage of zero entries, however, these techniques are efficient in terms of both computer storage and computation. System of uh, this type arise frequently in circuit analysis computational fluid and structure dynamics with uh, boundary value problems and partial differential equations. The simplicity of this method is both good and bad. Good because it's relatively easy to understand, bad because uh, it requires initial guessing and uh, not typically used in practice. So let's consider an example. This is a linear system of three equations with three variables. Make sure that the system is diagonally dominated, which means that the diagonal variables have largest coefficients. Even if it is not, you need to arrange it. So separate the diagonal variables. Express x1 is a, x2 is b, and x3 is c. Type these three equations and calculator for x1, x2, and x3 in terms of a, b, and c. After you typed all the equations, go to the equation for x1 and press Kelsey button. Enter the initial guessed values. Repeat for x2 and x3 with its least five iterations as shown.
In the case of Gauss-Seidel method, where we use the most recent value of variables, this leads to the fact that it becomes fast converging method compared to Jacobi, therefore it is more superior than Jacobian methods. Follow the steps for calculations. I hope you will find it helpful. Thanks for watching.